but you can see the design say the secret of the 4D is that inside this probe there is a motor board that can move the transducer scanning in different sections. So the software can combine all the images scan and into one 3D mode. The Soroscope doesn't have a metrics probe? No. I think for the matrix probe only G Philips and Siemens and maybe Toshiba. I think only this for Five D. Uh, yeah. Are you talking about five D? Five D. I think it's uh, something magic. Yeah. They just make it five D. Not five D. <laughs> 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 they just call it five D. Four D. Four D. Uh, normally, the doctor uses it to see the fetus. Fetus. Yeah. The baby. <laughs> Your fetus. <laughs> If you uh, we want to use 3D or 4D, we just uh, scan the section of the baby and press here 3D or 4D, and we choose 3D or 4D here. 3D means just one image, and 4D means it's live. Okay. So here we can set. So, what is that? Two boxes. Sorry, two boxes. I mean, corners. With this box and this corner. Corners are there. Yes. This box. What is it for? Uh, the software will only make the <coughs> the audience inside the box as a three D or four D model. Okay. So, it amiotic, means amniotic fluid should be immersed. Uh, I mean, uh, baby should be should be immersed in this amniotic fluid, no? Uh, it really depends. It depends which part that the doctor want to see. Okay. Maybe the doctor only want to see the face. You just put the face here. Okay. No, yeah. I was asking uh, whether the amniotic fluid should be inside this box or should be a, a box should be bigger than that amniotic fluid. A bigger, area. yes, a little bit bigger. And we can see the press face. And this is the 4D. If you freeze it. It is a 3D. Okay. 